Today we're going to take a look at the Hopkins passenger side six function smart light trailer tail light with the test lights for under 80 inch wide trailers. Now this trailer light will serve six functions, has a stop light, tail light, turn signal, side marker, side reflex reflector, re-reflex reflector, and it is designed for trailers less than 80 inches wide. This light does use the unique smart light design that has these built in test lights right here on the side that'll let you troubleshoot a wiring problem. Up at the top has a S, and then above that an LED light, that's for the stop and turn. In the middle has a T, and an LED above that, that's for the tail light. And at the bottom there's an LED light, and underneath it has G, that's for the ground. But basically what happens is the S and the T, those will light up to show that your trailer is receiving power, and the ground will not light up if it's got a good ground. If you happen to have a bad ground, that LED for the G or the ground will start flashing, that will indicate a bad ground, and basically a poor ground is your most common problem with trailer wiring. Now those test lights I'm going to show you when I hook this up how they operate. This is in a submersible polypropylene construction. It's ideal for boat trailers. They do use incandescent bulbs which are easily replaceable. The main bulb right here is an 1157 bulb. It's for the stop, turn, and tail lights. And on the side marker it's a 193 bulb. This light does accept the industry standard three-prong plug. If you already have an existing plug, you could use that one. If not, they do include this PL3 pigtail harness. That's included if you don't have that existing plug. It is a surface mount design. You can see it has the included studs. The slide is DOT, Department of Transportation, and SAE compliant. It does meet the Federal Motor Vehicle Safety Standards and the Canadian Motor Vehicle Safety Standard requirements. This one is a right-hand passenger side mm -hmm. configuration. The mounting studs we mentioned give you measurement on that center to center. They are two inches apart. The harness here, the wire configuration, the white wire with the eyelet on it is the ground. The red is the stop and turn, and the black is your tail light. The harness length is about 10 inches. A few dimensions on the light. Overall width, end to end, is going to be right at 5 and 3 eighths inches wide. Overall height, right at 4 and a half inches tall. And the depth on the light is right at about two and nine sixteenths inches deep. So what I'm going to do now is let's go ahead and put the three-prong plug in. Okay, push that right in. Now we'll hook up our wires. So we'll go ahead and take our ground, hook that up to your white wire. And we'll go ahead and take our red, which is your stop and turn. And then we'll take our black wire, which is your tail light. We'll go ahead and hook that up, make sure we got a good connection on all of them. Go ahead and turn our 12-volt power on. See the light comes on, we'll go ahead and turn off our overhead lights. So you can see there's your tail light. And turn it, there's your side marker light. And just to show you, when you apply the brakes. Oh, I forgot to mention, if you notice, go back to the tail light with it on. If you'll notice the middle light, the T is on. You'll see the test light right here is showing that it's on so it's working correctly. And then you'll notice as we hit the brakes you'll notice the light gets brighter and then if you look at the top test light it's showing on also. And then same on the turn signals. And if you notice we had mentioned the very bottom light, the G, which is the ground light, it is not on which means you have a good ground. Just to show you what would happen if you didn't, I'm going to take off the ground. And you'll notice its lights aren't working because you don't have a good ground. And you'll notice the red test light on the bottom where the G is is flashing. So once you get your ground corrected, you'll see it then it works all properly. Very nice smart light system. So we'll go ahead and turn back on our overhead lights. Turn off our power. But that should do it for the review on the Hopkins passenger side six function smart light trailer tail light with the test lights for under 80 inch wide trailers.